In the labyrinthine corridors of the universe, amidst the infinite expanse of stars, lies a shadow truth, an enigma shrouded in the fabric of our existence. What if I told you that behind the veil of our everyday lives, a cosmic mystery lingers? Picture this, each of us, unwittingly entwined with celestial threads, connected to an otherworldly legacy that eludes our conscious awareness. Today, dear voyagers, we plunge into the depths of the unknown, exploring a controversial and tantalizing concept. The notion that perhaps, just perhaps, you are a star seed, but hold your doubts close, for this journey delves into realms far beyond the conventional. Buckle up as we navigate through skepticism, unraveling the enigmatic ties that bind us to the cosmos. Are you prepared to question the very foundations of your existence? Join me in an expedition fraught with uncertainty, as we dare to ponder the possibility that you, indeed, might be a starseed. Star seeds, a term popularized by Dolores Cannon, are individuals believed to have originated from other planetary systems or dimensions and are now incarnated on Earth. Dolores Cannon, a renowned hypnotherapist and researcher in the field of past life regression, metaphysics, and extraterrestrial encounters, explored the concept of star seeds extensively through her numerous sessions with clients under deep hypnosis. Cannon's work delved into the idea that star seeds are souls who have lived past lives in different realms, planets, or galaxies before choosing to incarnate on Earth to assist in the planet's spiritual evolution and awakening. According to her findings, these individuals often feel a sense of detachment from earthly matters and possess an inherent feeling of being different or alien to this world. In canon sessions, starseeds were described as having unique characteristics and experiences that set them apart. They often exhibit a strong sense of empathy, heightened intuition, an innate understanding of spiritual concepts, and a feeling of not fully belonging to human society. Many starseeds feel a deep connection to the cosmos, a longing for home without fully understanding where or what that home might be. Dolores Cannon's research into starseeds revealed that these individuals often have missions or purposes on Earth related to spiritual awakening, healing, or raising the planet's vibration. Some starseeds may experience challenges adjusting to the density and limitations of the physical world due to their strong connection to higher dimensions or realms. Their ultimate goal is to assist humanity in its collective ascension by spreading love, light, and wisdom. Cannon's work didn't just focus on the description of star seeds, but also explored their origins and roles. According to her findings, star seeds originate from various star systems or galaxies, such as Sirius, Pleiades, Arcturus, and others. Each group of star seeds is believed to bring unique qualities and knowledge beneficial to Earth's spiritual progression. Moreover, Cannon's research suggested that star seeds may experience a sense of awakening or activation triggered by specific events, encounters, or spiritual experiences. This awakening often leads them to explore their cosmic origins, spiritual gifts, and the greater purpose behind their presence on Earth. Many star seeds embark on a journey of self-discovery, seeking to align with their higher purpose and contribute positively to humanity's collective consciousness. In the hushed confines of a dimly lit room, a solitary figure sat, the weight of an enigmatic truth resting heavily upon their shoulders. The air crackled with an unsettling energy as cryptic whispers echoed within the chamber's confines. Earth was not your first home, murmured the figure their voice tinged with an eerie certainty. The words lingered, unsettling the very fabric of reality, offering a glimpse into an unfathomable cosmic mystery. It was as though the universe itself held its breath, waiting for the revelation to unfold. The realization gnawed at the edges of consciousness, igniting a relentless curiosity that begged for answers veiled in celestial secrecy. With each passing moment, the enigma of a forgotten existence beyond terrestrial realms unfolded, shrouding the room in an aura of inexplicable tension and mystery. Dolores Cannon's perspective, based on her extensive research in hypnotherapy and regression sessions with clients, proposed the idea that Earth might not be the first home for some souls. 
Through her work, Cannon explored the concept of reincarnation and the notion that souls have experienced multiple lifetimes in various dimensions, planetary systems, or realms before incarnating on Earth. Cannon's findings derived from deep hypnosis sessions suggested that souls have a continuous journey of evolution and growth, experiencing different existences in the universe. According to her, souls may choose to incarnate on different planets or realms to gain diverse experiences and knowledge. Her regression sessions often reveal past lives of individuals as beings from other planets or dimensions. These souls, as per Cannon's research, might have lived lives in different cosmic environments or civilizations before choosing to incarnate on Earth for various purposes. Cannon's observations led her to propose that Earth is a significant learning ground or a school for souls at a particular stage of their evolution. Souls might have chosen to come to Earth for experiences that facilitate spiritual growth, learning lessons, contributing to collective consciousness, or assisting in the planet's evolution. She suggested that memories of these previous existences might be buried in the subconscious, but can sometimes surface through dreams, intuition, or during deep hypnotic regression sessions. These buried memories or feelings of not fully belonging to Earth could be indicators for some individuals that they have had experiences elsewhere before coming here. It's important to note that Cannon's findings and perspectives are within the realms of metaphysical and spiritual exploration. They are based on her interpretations of her clients' experiences under hypnosis and do not have empirical scientific evidence to support them. In essence, Dollars Cannon's work suggested the possibility that Earth might not be the initial or only home for some souls, and that these souls may have traversed various realms or dimensions before choosing to embark on a human experience on this planet. Her teachings continue to intrigue those interested in exploring the broader scope of existence, reincarnation, and the soul's journey across the cosmos. In the labyrinthine recesses of the mind, a haunting sensation tiptoed along the fringes of consciousness, a lingering feeling of being out of place, an inexplicable dissonance with the world. It was as though a spectral hand had reached from the ethereal realms, leaving a ghostly imprint upon the soul. The unease, subtle yet relentless, whispered of an enigmatic past that eluded comprehension, a tale shrouded in cosmic mysteries. With each passing moment, the unease grew, gnawing at the very fabric of existence. Shadows danced on the periphery, weaving a tapestry of uncertainty, veiling the truth in layers of obscurity. A cryptic yearning resonated within, an echo of forgotten origins beckoning to unravel the enigma behind this profound sense of displacement. In the silence, the feeling lingered, an enigmatic specter teasing the edges of comprehension, leaving one suspended in a nebulous realm between the known and the elusive. In Dolores Cannon's spiritual belief system, the feeling of being out of place or not fully belonging to one's current environment might be attributed to various factors derived from her extensive research in hypnotherapy and regression sessions. According to Cannon, individuals who feel out of place or experience a sense of not belonging on Earth might be exhibiting signs of being starseeds. Starseeds, in Cannon's spiritual philosophy, are individuals whose souls have originated from other planets, dimensions, or realms beyond Earth. These souls may have had previous incarnations in different cosmic environments before choosing to inhabit a human form on Earth. Cannon suggests that such individuals might retain subconscious memories or impressions of their past existences in other worlds or realms. These buried memories could manifest as feelings of displacement, alienation, or a sense of not fitting into the societal norms and expectations of Earth. Additionally, these individuals might possess heightened sensitivity, intuition, or unique abilities that set them apart from others contributing to their sense of being different or out of place in the earthly realm. Furthermore, according to Cannon's research, these star seeds might have incarnated on Earth for specific purposes, such as assisting in the planet's spiritual evolution, contributing unique perspectives, 
or aiding humanity during times of transformation or awakening. However, it's important to note that Canon's beliefs about star seeds and feelings of not belonging are within the realms of metaphysical and spiritual interpretation. They are based on her interpretations of her clients' experiences under hypnosis and regression sessions, which might not have empirical scientific validation. Overall, according to Canon's spiritual perspective, the sensation of feeling out of place could potentially stem from subconscious memories or impressions of a soul's previous experiences in other cosmic realms, leading to a sense of displacement or a feeling of not entirely fitting into the earthly environment. In the stillness of a quiet night, an enigmatic revelation flickers like a distant star amidst the vast cosmic tapestry, an enigma that whispers of celestial origins. A sense of longing, veiled in ethereal secrets, befalls those who find solace in the silent embrace of solitude and seek refuge from the clamor of crowded spaces. In the depths of their being, an inexplicable resonance resonates, a mysterious connection to distant galaxies, an inexplicable kinship with the cosmic unknown. It's as though their very essence is woven from stardust, carrying echoes of celestial whispers that beckon from realms beyond mortal comprehension. The yearning for tranquility, the relentless pursuit of serenity amid a cacophony of existence, echoes an ancient tale etched in the constellations, a tale of souls who yearn for the tranquility of their celestial home amidst the chaos of earthly realms. The subtle echoes of being a star seed, veiled beneath the guise of human form, dance tantalizingly on the fringes of recognition, a cosmic riddle yet to be unraveled, casting an otherworldly aura upon those who harbor the celestial yearning within. Dolores Cannon's Exploration of Star Seeds Individuals believed to originate from other planets or dimensions touches upon various behavioral traits and preferences that might suggest one's connection to a different cosmic origin. Cannon suggests that certain characteristics including an inclination towards solitude and a preference for peace over crowded places, could potentially indicate a person's identification as a starseed. According to Cannon's perspectives derived from her extensive hypnotherapy and regression sessions, starseeds might exhibit a sense of feeling different or detached from the earthly norms and societal structures. This could translate into a preference for solitude, introspection, and serene environments over bustling, crowded places. Individuals who resonate with the qualities of a star seed might feel more attuned to quietude, finding solace in moments of solitude. This preference could stem from a deeper connection to their cosmic origins or past lives in realms characterized by tranquility and harmony. Furthermore, Canon proposes that star seeds often possess heightened sensitivities, empathy, and intuition which might make crowded or noisy environments overwhelming or energetically draining for them. Their sensitivity to energy and their desire for tranquility might lead them to seek out serene spaces conducive to introspection and spiritual growth. However, it's essential to note that Canon's understanding of star seeds and their behavioral traits is based on metaphysical and spiritual interpretations drawn from her regression sessions these interpretations might not have empirical scientific validation and are within the realm of metaphysical beliefs. In essence, according to Cannon's beliefs, an individual's inclination towards solitude, a preference for peace, and discomfort in crowded places might suggest a resonance with the traits commonly associated with star seeds, an affinity for serene environments, and a subtle sense of detachment from the earthly paradigms. In this maze of cosmic curiosities and celestial wonders, remember this, the greatest mysteries often lie within ourselves. As we draw the veil on today's journey into the enigmatic realm of star seeds, let these mysteries linger in your thoughts. Question the ordinary, embrace the unknown, and nurture the cosmic whispers echoing within your soul. As you traverse your path, may these revelations ignite a spark a spark that propels you to explore, question, and seek the extraordinary in the ordinary. For the cosmic canvas is vast, and within its brushstrokes, every being, perhaps, holds a cosmic heritage waiting to be realized. Until we embark on our next odyssey of discovery, keep exploring, keep pondering, and remember, 
The truth is often more astounding than fiction. Stay curious, fellow cosmic travelers, for the universe, with all its secrets, awaits our next quest.